Here we'll have ants taking on a looper pillar. This is a pest that destroys a lot of the flowers from the swamp plant. The ants work as a team. They're biting. The other one has looked like it's succumbed. That's a green one. This is the yellow one. They're biting. The thing is curling up. It may squash the old ant, but the ants determined. They're extremely powerful. These are tiny ants. When you look at the capacity where they can move. The other device is already rendered inoperational. They determined those ends. And they will destroy the device. It looks like the device is already leaking. So the capacity will be reduced slowly. And obviously the ends that communicate to each other is pheromone. Attack, attack, said the ends. Suffering profusely. Insect life in a garden or in a controlled environment is quite interesting to see how they work. And again, it's not like a lion uh, killing a deer, the choking it. Now, Insects, they eat life prey. A little fight going on here between the looper and the ants, and the ants are determined to get a source of protein. There's the orangey looper that's being dealt with and still moving around. It is uh, power in numbers. Green looper is under siege. It's trying to climb up the wall. Oh, look at that. Was, there was an instant reaction there. Top speed, top speed. going on here. Ants are like the hyenas of the insects really if you look at it. They're working as a pack team. No one is still fighting. Except yesterday, so cleaning those up really active. These devices they're pretty tough, these loopers keep fighting back. You hear pain, though, things because they destroy a lot of flowers in your garden. Corpse of another device, can't remember what it was. Orange one is still being punished, still moving. A lot of the energy level has been slowly depleted from the internal battery of the device.
these ants are simply amazing. This is not wasp switch, this is ant switch. I think the orange looper has sustained irreparable damage. The ants got it under control. The other green which was passing already has been damaged beyond repair and is being disassembled slowly by the ants. And this last green one is still hanging in there, it's doing really well. Quite a powerful device. It's not happy. Hands don't give up. Definitely the ants are the hyena in the insect world. It's my in my opinion I must say. And it's just amazing how well they work as a team. This caterpillar has no chance of surviving, it's being pulled away by one little ant. This is the overall remote situation. We've got an orange one there, green one, posse one there, and we got uh, the green one. This is still battling there, and still active, still fighting back. That device is gone. This device is, I would say, more or less a gunner as well, it's gone. And this number three is just hanging in there, it's powerful. It's fighting hard. So do the ants. Maybe not that easy, this caterpillar. I would say it will sustain damage on its external body wall, so it will start leaking, and then the ants will rip into it. But this is nature. I know some people say it's cool. It's nature. You see this happen on the plants. I saw it just documented for uh, scientific purposes.
here we get the ends highway, ends being commanded to come inside the enclosure and doing the bit. Well, at the moment I think this event is going on for about 10 minutes, 10-15 minutes. Full power and the end, gee, it's amazing. It managed to shake itself clear again. This is another five minutes later, this is the number three caterpillar. I think it's start losing energy. And the ants, I think they have taken over more or less. Although they're not biting it as much as I thought, they may have put poison in the thing anyway till it dies. There's that leaky one. Number one has been consumed, and the orange one uh, is draining the liquids out of the device. Not much left from the wasp. You look at that, it's changing the whole body is being moved. It's just amazing.